Welcome back. In this video, we're going to talk about properties of linear systems. So we're going to look at when two lines are graphed on the same coordinate system, uh, how many solutions there are. And by solution, what we mean is how many times, or if at all, do those two lines intersect with each other. So let's have a look at the first situation. All right, so here's our first situation. We've got a graph of negative 2xy plus y equals 2, and I've got 2x plus y equals 2 graphed here. Uh, and what you're going to notice uh, is these two lines, they intersect with each other. So what is our, how many solutions does this have? So, well, you notice right here, this is where the two lines intersect. So where exactly is that, in fact? Well, uh, we notice here that this is at 0, 2. Okay? So there is one solution for this system, and it is at 0, 2 few things I want you to notice. I want you to notice that their slopes are different. The slope for the blue line is negative 2 and the slope for the red line is positive 2. So those slopes are different and whenever you have two straight lines with a different slope, with different slopes rather, uh, they're going to intersect in one and only one place. And in this case, it's at 0, 2. All right, here's our next question we're going to look at. We're going to look at, in red, we've got negative uh, 2x plus y equals 2. And in blue, we have negative 2x plus y equals 4. Okay, so the first thing you're going to notice is the value of the slopes. So what is it? All right, so for this blue line, it's 2 over 1. And for the red line, it's also 2 over 1. So these two lines have the same slope. When lines have the same slope, they are parallel. All right, now are these parallel lines ever going to meet? Are they ever going to intersect with each other? No. Because parallel lines, they have to be equidistant from each other forever. So at no point ever are they ever going to touch, intersect, and therefore this system has no solution. All right, let's move on to the next one. All right, so here's our last situation. Uh, we've got two lines graphed separately, and I want you to see what happens when I graph them on the same grid. Wow, okay, so it looks like one of the lines is has gotten lost, or it looks like I've only graphed one line. Well, that's actually because these two lines, they end up being graphed right on top of each other. If you notice uh, right here, we've got two different lines, essentially. Uh, they've got different equations, but if you notice, this one is simply a multiple of this one here. And if you figure out the slopes of these two lines, they're exactly the same. Uh, also, the y-intercepts of these two lines are exactly the same. Essentially, they're coincident lines. They exist on the same place at the same time. And if you want a little bit more of a proof, I've shown you here a table of values so that you can see that at negative 5, they both have a value of negative 8. And let's look at one that's actually on the graph here. Uh, so for both lines at x equals 0, the value of y is 2 for both of them. So they both have a y-intercept of 2. They both have an x-intercept of negative 1. So this system has an infinite 
number of solutions because at every single point on the graph, they meet. All right, so that concludes uh, this video. I hope you take the opportunity to go through the exercises and have some fun with this. Good luck, folks.